Hi guys, welcome to another video on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add text to your video using Filmora 10. So why I want to make this tutorial? Because whenever we have a new version, then we need to make another tutorial for beginners. So that's why I want to make this and adding text to your video is one of the most uh, common use feature when editing video. Uh, I know that and that's why you are here watching my tutorial. Okay, so in Filmora 10, it is very easy. Just go to Filmora 10. I'm going to show you just some simple steps. You will know everything about this uh, text editor. It is very simple. So uh, here I am in Filmora 10. So in order to add text to your video, so we need video, right? I already imported some footage uh, that I downloaded from uh, pixel.com. So uh, here in the media library and I already put it on the timeline and to save your time I already render it so uh, it's look uh, like a green line here on the timeline so it's, it's render for better uh, better playback and you can watch the video smoothly okay and to add text to your video in Filmora 10 all you need to do is to go to this tab title tab so uh, this is one of seven main feature of the, uh, Filmora 10 so the title tabs include everything, Your, a normal title, lower third, uh, subtitle, uh, callouts, animated text, and templates. So everything is inside here about text, okay? Uh, let's see like it. Here you see that uh, there are many, many, many templates in Filmora 10 you can add to your video. About nearly 500 different templates you can use. So the, the main folder, subfolder. Uh, so the main folder including uh, favorite, uh, that is something that uh, some template uh, you like. And then you put a hot, uh, you hit the hot button and then it will bring to your favorite. Uh, favorite means you can use for your next project okay and here's the included folder included folder there's many template here uh, for example this opener a lot of opener and it is 42 different type title normal title you can uh, drag and drop it into your video uh, just uh, double click on any templates uh, to review it on the uh, here review it here if you're happy just drag and drop it onto the timeline uh, like this you just drag and drop it here so remember when drag and drop your title onto the timeline just put it on top of your video on the on top of your video or above your video uh, not under it if you put under it it cannot show on in your video okay like this and uh, here's just an example okay let's delete it so there are many more here for example lower third 43 and even in the new concept there's uh, more 40 40 so uh, total 83 uh, lower third when you install the program and there are more more at the uh, film stock folder where I download more so here for example at the film stock uh, we even have a lot more lower third and title and subtitle uh, template so you can add to your video so it's uh, it is too many I never use all of them I just use some of them okay so uh, for example this is a lower third uh, let's drag and drop a lower third onto the timeline so this is a template so including text and animation okay and this one uh, let's review it oh it's nice uh, so I just drag and drop it and put it here then we have a lower third added to our video like this great right now we need to customize it so in order to customize your title uh, there's two uh, two editor the first is the basic editor and the second is advanced sorry advanced ed, uh, text editor uh, so before doing that uh, we need to uh, for example we can change the duration of the title here we can select at the edge of the uh, title box and then drag it to all the way to the right to extend the duration of the title or drag it to the left to shorten the, the duration of the title okay so you understand how to change the duration of the title right and we can release our mouse so that is the first option and if we want uh, if we don't want the text to appear here then we can move it along the timeline so it is how the title work uh, so it is not in this position anymore it is in this position okay now to customize i will show you some way to customize your title the first way to just double click on your title box uh, double click on this 
and here is the basic uh, title editor but before before trying to uh, adjust the fonts change the size and uh, change the text uh, we need to know this one so this is a new feature in Fimura 10 the title group controller so this is this is the controller for the group of title including your text animation and preset right inside this uh, so you can scale change the position and rotate this group uh, let me let me show you so in order to scale uh, you can scale it bigger and then you move the, change the position of this one uh, of this one and increase this y aso uh, to bring it here and then change it uh, okay, you can also type the number here, for example, 100, and say okay, uh, not enough, and then you can type 200. Okay, so it is uh, here. So that is how you can can uh, change a scale or change the position of the groups, title group in Fimura 10. Yeah, so you can also adjust this manually here. So for example, you can click here and then resize the, the, the text and see, click here and resize this preset. So that is uh, how you normally do in Fimura 9. But now in Fimura 10, you have a group, a title group controller. Okay, so that is the first option. Let's click OK and double click on the title box again to bring up the uh, basic text editor. Okay. Here, for example, you can change the text. Uh, let's change it to my name. All right, and then change the fonts uh, to be bust. Okay, so my favorite fonts. And then uh, you can also increase the text space here. And line space, line space down below. If you have to line uh, in in this uh, in this uh, box, uh, you can increase the line. But now I'm not going to. Uh, to add more line here and you can adjust the alignment here uh, for example this is a center this one and this one so uh, it will be the on the screen uh, if you put it here it will be at the center it will be at the center of the screen but uh, never mind you can just uh, move it here okay and here at the transform tab so you have you can rotate the text like this or you can just rotate it by at this button right and you can scale it up and scale it down right so it's easy right it, this is just the basic uh, text editor in Fimura 10 and there's more option down here for example the blending mode but we are not going to touch the blending mode here um, yeah by the way you have 15 different blending mode for your title you can choose for example if you uh, choose screen then it will yeah, just merge with the, the video layer below it but never mind we don't uh, need to uh, to do this now and on the left side uh, let's change it to normal okay on the left side you have the title property so at the title property you have text uh, where you can add a preset uh, like this if you choose a reset for this and uh, first you need to select it on the preview windows and then you can select a preset here for example i can change it to the yellow uh, so look how the text change right uh, so that is a preset you can choose any any preset here and once you change the preset and you can uh, come here again to customize it uh, so it's easy uh, so at the video tab you have transform where you can rotate scale and position of the title so this title uh, here and the compositing you have the, some planning option so that is similar when you double click on the title box here so let's double click on the title box again and you see here the transform and it is compositing so this is the basic text editor in Fimura 10 so let's go to the advanced edit um, meaning advanced uh, text editor in Fimura 10 so there are two ways you can go to to that just double click on the title box and then click on this advanced button that is the first option and the second option you can right click on the title box on the timeline and go to advanced edit so that is the second option let's click on that okay so here is uh, the advanced tech editor in Fimura 10 so these these are the options. for example customize uh, you are able to change the color of your text uh, let's change it to blue 
like this and then you can also uh, change the border of your text uh, here down here uh, so there are many options here uh, but customize to customize your text you need uh, to spend a little bit more time um, maybe and your designing skill right so uh, you can also change the text border and text shadow and opacity and size and also size of the border and so and so on so in order uh, to change it you go to customize and you can also change it to preset uh, right here for example i can choose this preset and uh, added to that you, you are able to edit animation for your text and to add an animation firstly you need to select the text track here and then select the animation and select one of these many so there are many an animation effect for your text uh, you can choose right here uh, for example i can choose this uh, rig text okay let double click to, to select it and now now you have the animation yeah for your text and to control the the entrance effect you use this uh this white uh white white bar or the slider or something and to control the exit you drag uh, this one to the left or to the right to control the animation of your text okay uh, let's see this one so it is uh, a little bit fast you might want to slow it down i just re drag it all the way to the right and let's see it see this uh, it's slow right the animation slow and to remove the uh, to remove the animation effect uh, here we can select the text track and then we click on this remove I uh, know uh, click on this no animation just double click and it has no animation right yeah, for example like this okay so right inside this uh, text editor you can add more text uh, to this box to the title box on the timeline so it is on the timeline and you can add more text by clicking on this button okay select this and you have more text here so this is the first tag uh, for the lower third and maybe you can change it here to a title amazing title all right so you can also change the size the fonts and the color of this one uh, go to customize and then you can change it to something that you like here all right so how about adding animation to it uh, let's choose this one typewriter okay and then adjust the animation right here so the first one has no animation and the second one has animation like this and to delete a title uh, or a text inside this tag editor you can just select it and then press this button delete button okay so that is how to delete it and there are more tools here if you want to uh, add shape to your to your video you can uh, add right here for example i want to add this arrow okay and you see that that here this is arrow and you can add more shape like uh, this bubble right and scale it position it and add text to the, this bubble it is it right and there's some more control here for example this is a phones you can change the phones right and this is a sign you can change the sign uh, this is the text you can change the text direction you can change it from horizon uh, horizontal to vertical okay and let's press ctrl z to undo it uh, so you can uh, uh, you can also increase uh, this one is similar to uh, the space between line uh, line here and this is the space between character yeah so you can increase the size and then increase it here right and there's a, there's another here's the arrangement of your text layer and you can click here and send to backward or forward bring it forward bring to form front or send backward right inside here so it is very powerful text editor here okay and you can even zoom in and zoom out the timeline and uh, the preview of the timeline here so this is a text timeline okay so let's delete some uh, some stuff that I showed you and that I show you 
so for example uh, this is what I love to use next time uh, I want to add this lower third to my video next time uh, what should I do uh, let's click on this save as custom okay let's uh, save it and then put it Jackie one okay let's click OK now click OK to go back to the timeline let's click OK and so where is my Jackie one okay it is in custom folder uh, let's find it let's click OK to go back and go to title and see here you have the custom folder and let's find the Jackie one so I have so many um, custom folder okay so here the Jackie one for the next project if I create a new project uh, it is still here so everything is still here I just drag and drop it onto the timeline to use it and it's already customized nice right so that is how you can add text and edit your text on your video in Filmora 10 I don't want to make a, uh, the video too long because uh, I just want to make it uh, it's a short video a short tutorial for, for you guys to understand uh, about this uh, software by the way because I want to explain everything so that you can understand uh, everything about this tech editor and then you can just uh, making a great video uh, without watching other tutorial on my channel so I hope you guys enjoy the tutorial if you have any question let me know at the comment section below Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.